Hey lovely sugars, welcome back to Anxiety Art Adventures. Uh, I am going to be doing a video today showing you my current whips. I have six current whips and I've had a lot of people message me and ask me what, what are they? What, what are you working on? Um, so I figured the easiest way is to just show you my whips. Now I'm going to show you uh, whip stands for work in progress for those of you that are new. Uh, I'm going to show you my newest whip down to my oldest whip, which it's shameful. Shameful, y'all. Shameful. Okay, I normally, and l let me just preface this, I normally do not have this many whips going at the same time. Uh, I used to be in the mindset of only working on one diamond painting at a time, and I don't know exactly when that mindset changed, but I just one day was like, Life is too short to only be working on one diamond painting at a time when I have so many, so many diamond paintings, you guys, so many, as I'm sure a lot of us do. And I have plenty in my stash to work on and I just decided, you know what, if I wake up one day and I want to start a new diamond painting, that's what I'm going to do. So, all right, we're going to start the newest one first. Uh, you guys have seen me. And I'm sorry for the camera on this, but these are huge. Um, you've seen me working on this. This is Siamese Tees from Diamond Art Club. And it is, uh, of course, by the wonderful Manny Manzano. Um, I have done the entire bottom row. Um, I don't think I'm going to have to roll it to show you. Um, this is a 55 by 102 centimeters, so it is one of the long, narrow ones. But I have done the entire bottom section of the canvas. Here, let me pull that back so you can see. The reds in this canvas are just phenomenal. Phenomenal. Um, I just, I can't, I can't get over the reds in this. It's just, it's gorgeous. Um, and excuse the lighting, I had to move my uh, ring lights away from the canvas so you don't get the glare. Isn't that just gorgeous? So yeah, so I have done the bottom section. And what I do is I take, I have five by five parchment paper squares. Um, and I do one row at a time. So I just have, you know, I think this was four, yeah, this was four sections across with the parchment paper. Um, and then I'll do that going forward and just keep the plastic on it as I go. That makes it easier and it protects the diamond painting more. So absolutely love this canvas. Um, I've had this in my stash for whew, probably about a year. Um, so I will say the black 310s are awesome. Um, I know there's been a lot of issues with dark colored drills uh, recently in the community. But since this kit was older, I got a good batch of three tons. Uh, so I'm very pleased with uh, the three tons so far. Um, and not a lot of trash. I have had very minimal trash uh, on this painting so far. So that is Siamese Teas by Manny Manzano. That is my newest whip. Um, I am working on this for my event, Magical Mandy 2021, that goes till the end of the year. And uh, at the end of the year, I will pull a random winner from a whip and chat uh, from that diamond painting uh, whip and chat. And you will be entered to win a $50 Diamond Art Club gift card from me. Um, and full disclosure, that gift card is for me exclusively. I am in no way affiliated with Diamond Art Club, so I will be buying that gift card myself for one of you lovelies. Okay. Um, what is happening here? Okay. All right. This is the next most current whip. Yikes. Okay. This is from Diamond Art Club as well. This is the um, Governor's Party. This is the Governor's Mansion in Virginia. And I live in Virginia, so I absolutely had to get this. I didn't care that it was a square diamond painting. I knew this was going to take me a long time. I don't care. Uh, my husband and I have talked about it, and whenever I finish this, hopefully before, you know, I'm six feet under, uh, we will get this framed, and we're going to hang this up in our dining room, um, so we have this to look at when we um, 
you know, do Thanksgiving and Christmas uh, here at our house with our family. So I have done these bottom two, sorry for the glare. I've done these bottom two sections. And the drills are just fabulous. Fabulous. I've done some A, have I done ABs yet? I've done a teeny tiny bit of ABs, the little white ABs right there. But this one is going a lot better than I thought it would. Um, I'm taking my time with it. Uh, I'll be really honest with you. I am not using a multi-placer. I am checkerboarding, and that seems to be working really well for me. So, okay. So that is The Governor's Party by Diamond Art Club. And this is a Chuck Pinson, by the way, uh, for those of you that didn't know. Uh, Chuck Pinson is known for his beautiful landscape diamond paintings, um, or I'm sorry, for his landscape paintings. And he just, they're just gorgeous, but they're always very large, very detailed, and they take a lot of time, but they are absolutely gorgeous. And I'm a huge fan of his, so. Okay, I'm gonna put this one over here to the side. Okay. Uh, this next one is from Crystal Art. So crystalcanvas.us. All of their canvases are in rhinestone. So I have started this canvas. I've done the bottom, eh, just about halfway over on the bottom. Um, here, let me take the plastic off so you can see that better. Uh, this one is a 40 by 50 and it's called a uh, succulent succulent cactus i think but if y'all can see that is all rhinestone um i started this and it's okay it's it's not what i thought it was going to be like i thought i was going to be like blinding in your face uh with bling bling but it's okay. I mean, it's not, it's not bad. The canvas is really clear. You can see the symbols easily. There's a lot of color blocking, which is good. Um, yeah. So, and I, I was really debating whether or not to come on camera to show this one or not, because I can't find the artist on this one. I know they do have licensed artwork on their site. Um, but I can't find the artist on this one. So I was a little hesitant to show this one. Um, so I'm not going to show me working on this one on the channel. Um, but I wanted to try a complete crystal canvas. So there we go. Started that one. Okay. Let me know how many of you have a crystal canvas from crystalcanvas.us or crystal art. Um, and let me know your thoughts. Okay. Now, this one is from Sparkle Queen. Uh, I started this one uh, earlier in the year and I absolutely love, oh that's crooked, <laughs> I absolutely love the artwork. My camera is like, yikes. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to fix it so it's not so. Okay, I love the artwork, absolutely love it. Um, the drills, the drills have been, I'll be really honest with you, I've had a lot of trash in the drills, but so far I've had enough to finish, you know, this much of the diamond painting and I still have plenty of drills, so I'm not worried about that. Uh, this one is 50 by 30 round drills. And I can't remember what this one is called. I think it's like rainbow, rainbow under the ocean something like that. Um, yeah, it's just, it's really pretty. I think it should probably be a larger size, but I absolutely love the fact that Sparkle Queen, all of her images are licensed. Um, you know, she's got a, a brand new set of diamond paintings that are coming out soon. I pre-ordered them, I think back in back in March, I think. So I'm waiting on those. Hopefully I'll get those soon. Uh, yeah, so uh, the one downfall, well, the other downfall besides the trash in this kit is this is a double-sided adhesive. Not really a fan, um, and you know it's a double-sided adhesive for those of you that are new when you get a white, 
white release paper on top of it. Um, it's just, it, it, the drills don't move. I mean, once you put the drill down, it's very difficult to move it. Um, so I'm just not a fan. I like pour glue better. Um, that's my personal opinion, but I do, I love, love the artwork. It's beautiful. Um, so yeah, I really need to finish this. I only have, I already started down here. I've worked on the yellow and the black. I only have, you know, three more sections to do. So I really need to go ahead and finish this sometime soon, right? <laughs> right. Okay. So that's whip number three. Okay. <clears throat> oh yes. All right. This is whip number four. This is also from Diamond Art Club. Probably can't see all of it. Uh, this is Toucan Threesome uh, by Carolyn Steele uh, from Diamond Art Club. So I have done this bottom section here. Zoe, don't touch. No, ma'am. Go. <laughs> I've got my diamond paintings on the floor and she wants to walk on them and sniff them. Uh, yeah, Toucan Threesome. This is a round drill cut. This is a 71 by 51 centimeter. And like I said, I've done this bottom section here. And you can see this one does have ABs. There are green ABs over here. <clears throat> there is, yeah, one AB in this, in this uh, kit. So I also bought this one earlier this year. Love the colors in this one. Absolutely love it. Um, the, it's so bright and just it's awesome. A whole lot of color blocking. Like this whole area over here is nothing but the yellow. And then there's a lot of black in the toucan. Um, so it's not a difficult diamond painting by any, by any means. It's just, you know. I kind of got bored with all of the color block, <laughs> but that's okay. Uh, and this one has 30 colors, so not a whole lot of colors either. Um, I don't know if this one is still available on their site, but you can check it out. I, I'm sure if it's not, it's available for pre-order. So, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Love the summer feel to that, like the tropical feel to that one. So, yes, that is Toucan Threesome. Okay, and that's round drill. I, th I think I said that. Okay. All right, now, this is my final whip. Now, this is my oldest whip. I've had this for probably over a year and a half. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is a square diamond painting. Uh, this is called, I'm pretty sure this is called Beach Beautiful Bridge. It is a 63 by 47 centimeter. Very odd, odd size there. Um, it has 38 colors and it has one AB, which is a white AB. Now, my husband picked this one out. This was probably, I think this was the first diamond painting that I got from Diamond Art Club. And I asked him, I said, you know, I wanna do one for you to hang up in your office. I want you to go through Diamond Art Club site and pick one. And this was before I knew about the other awesome diamond painting companies that are out there. Um, not to say Diamond Art Club isn't awesome. I love Diamond Art Club. But at the time, I only knew, you know, Amazon or Diamond Art Club. So uh, he picked this one out, and it is a square diamond painting. This diamond painting kit made me really dislike squares. I knew nothing about checkerboarding. I knew nothing about, you know, um, a ruler to help you with squares. And I was very new to diamond painting. And I just, I want to put this out there. My personal opinion, if you're new to diamond painting, I strongly recommend you to start with a round drill diamond painting kit. Um, it's much easier. You'll get a better feel for, you know, if you like the craft. Um, don't start off right away with a square. That's just my personal opinion. I know there are a lot of people that absolutely love squares and that's great. I'm, I'm starting to work on squares. Um, I'm taking my time with it. And if I get frustrated, I put it to the side and I work on a round. 
no big deal. Okay, so I have done up through here and then over here and to about here. Um, let's see if I can pull this back for you. Okay, just so you can see, it is gorgeous. The colors are just absolutely gorgeous. Love it. So I've told my husband my one of my goals for next year is to complete a square, at least one square diamond painting. And I was talking to him, uh, I think it was last night or the night before, and he was like, so does that mean you're going to finish my diamond painting? <laughs> he really wants this for his office. So I said, okay, I'm going to make sure this one gets finished for 2022. I have to finish this one, you all. I need your support to push me along to finish this one. Not for me, but for my husband. Um, he really wants a diamond painting. I've done one for my mom. I'm, I have one, you know, picked out for my dad and my stepmom. Um, you know, he's like, I've already done one for Sean. It's like, can I have mine now? <laughs> Poor guy. Um, yeah, so I, I want to complete this one um, for him. So, yeah. So, those are my six whips uh, that I have going. Now, I am getting ready to start this one. Um, actually, by the time you see this, um, today will be the day that I start it. I'm going to be doing this from uh, Escape from Eden from Craftably. Uh, this is by Tanya Shasiva, and it is 36 colors, um, no ABs. This is an older kit with no ABs. Um, so I have, you know, the drills. I have the, isn't that just, oh, love it. Um, and I'm doing this for the Too Hot for Summer diamond painting event that Patriotic Team is putting up. This event is for um, adult diamond paintings, but not too adult. Not too adult. No, 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 no. Um, all of the rules, if you just look up the hashtag on Instagram under um, too hot for summer diamond painting, uh, you'll see the rules um, on that hashtag. Uh, but this runs from August 1st to September 30th. So I'm hoping to get this done in August because September first we'll start girls and chills and I've got a Halloween diamond painting coming for that one so so those are my whips uh, let me know in the comments below what whips you have going uh, do you do more than one whip at a time let me know that in the comments below um, or do you prefer just working on one diamond painting at a time um, like I said I used to work on just one at a time um, but I have too many, y'all. I just have too many. Way too many. So, yeah. And this one to me is special because Adam picked it out. And I don't know if they offer this one anymore. Um, I'll have to look on their site. I don't remember seeing it, but I could be wrong. It could still be up there. Um, but it's just, it's a gorgeous diamond painting. Um, it reminds us of when we went to, um, Atlantis and the Bahamas. Uh, the water is exactly like that. It is just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So anyway, those are my six works in progress uh, that I'm working on. Soon to be seven. So I wanted to show them to you because since I had a lot of people asking me what were my whips. So there you go. Those are my whips. Um, yeah. So if you made it through this entire video, Thank you. Um, I also want to thank um, all of my channel members and everybody that watches my videos. Your support means the world to me, so thank you so much. Um, but if you did make it all the way through this diamond painting, uh, put a sun, something sunny. Um, yeah, because it's so freaking hot here. <laughs> I think it's going to be almost 100 degrees here today. So, okay. Thank you guys so much. I hope everybody has a fabulous rest of your weekend and I will see you again very soon. Bye guys.